Call of Duty Infinite Warfare is an absolute pile of turds. This game was one of the most disliked trailers in history. It had over 3 million dislikes on YouTube. 3 million. Ghostbusters only had 700,000 dislikes. This game had over 3 million dislikes. Well, let's talk about the most important part of the game. The graphics. Graphics are just terrible. Well, if you look at the game, it just looks terrible. Even for a next end game, it looks terrible. The graphics are, are bad. But now I want to talk about the game itself. The game is just, even now it's just trying to rip off Halo Reads. Which is a disgrace to gaming. That they're trying to rip off a game. The game came out first. And. This game is just a rip off of Halo Reach. Uh, it's the same game as last year. This is nothing new in this game. Um, nothing interesting. It's the same exact game as last year. So the most disliked games in history. Nobody is buying this game right now. Nobody is playing this game. Nobody likes Call of Duty anymore. Call of Duty, nobody liked any of the Call of Duty games. All the Call of Duty games are terrible. But this is the worst Call of Duty game yet. This is probably the worst game of the year, so this uh, so far. It's even worse than Uncharted 4. It's even worse than uh, Street Fighter 5. It's even worse than um, freaking Mafia 3. It's even worse than Paper Mario Color Splash and Metroid Prime Federation Force. This is one of the worst games of the year. Infinite Warfare is just a gay, retarded game. Like, if you look at the user scores for Infinite Warfare, they have even worse scores than No Man's Sky did. No Man's Sky got like a 4.5 on the user scores when it came out. And Infinite Warfare has a 2.0 on the computer PlayStation it has a 3.4 which is an absolute low score for the U for people according to critics of course it's likely Activision bribed them to give them the, the good high scores on Xbox One it has the unfavorable score of a 2.3 Which even the Ghostbusters movie got a higher score than. And for PC I said it got 2.0. And the game itself takes no skill. Because some of the games, even the bad, some bad games like No Man's Sky, at least they take some sort of skill. No Man's Sky, guy, I always took a bit of skill in Street Fighter V. Since it's a fighting game, a competitive game, it takes a bit of skill to master the characters. Infinite Warfare takes absolutely no skill whatsoever to even play the game. If you're a five-year-old, you can play this game easily because uh, all the guns, they're all the same. Certain weapons are useless compared to the others because all the weapons are the basically feel the same. And you can see it's that one of the reviews say that. Say that all the weapons feel the game. But that's in all the Call of Duty games. That's in all the Call of Duty games. People are saying this is this is. People, some people even saying Super Mario 64 is a better game than Call of Duty because Call of Duty is terrible. Call of Duty is one of the worst game series ever made, and it's the same game as last year. Like you look at current PC games, that game like Overwatch has a higher score. Battlefield One, Gears of War. I don't even know why they even released that game on the PC, Gears of War 4, but that ha but that's on the PC now. Doom has a higher score. 
Even No Man's Crap has a higher score than Infinite Warfare and the user scores. And we core. Which of course everything which is worse on PC than Xbox One. I don't even know why they even release we core on the PC. But nobody's gonna buy it on the PC anyways. But Infinite Warfare is the worst game of this year. It's it's there's no debate now, it's the worst game of the year. And if you bought this game and give it a 10 out of 10, you, you don't you don't deserve to call yourself a gamer. Because you give a game that nobody likes. Well, I'm going to look at YouTube, Infinite Warfare Trailer. Like, the user scores on Metacritic say, say it's bad. The people who, are, who actually play the game say it's bad. And... I'm just going to bring this up again. The YouTube. The trailer has over 3,000 dislikes. Infinite Warfare is the worst game of the year. The worst game. Nobody likes it. It's terrible. It's just, we're, we're sick of the same game every year. This is why we have to wait. This is why I don't have no Assassin's Creed game this year. It's because the game was so... Last game was so... Hated Assassin's Creed Syndicate. The game sold so poorly after the gritty mess of Unity. After lots of kids were disappointed with Unity and its terrible gameplay. And lots of people were disappointed. Not, not only kids played it, people were disappointed. Infinite Warfare will, mix, will single the death of the Call of Duty franchise. The death that many people have been waiting for of this terrible game series. So, that's basically what Infinite Warfare is. It's trash like Undertale. Nobody likes it. Like, the scores say Infinite Warfare is trash. Infinite Warfare is an absolute pile of turds.